you want to go and see Ed Sheeran and who wouldn't off to the website with you uh, and all the details will be there 10 o'clock tonight that's how long you have so we'll do a confession don't miss that we have some homework don't miss yes that. okay I succumbed I have bought myself a solar wind up radio this one here 12 pounds 19 pence off a of good old eBay everything is automatic tune watch this See, you just press a button, and it seeks its own channels. Yeah. If you don't know what's on, something else. So, idiot proof. Okay, so there's your channel selection right there. This is your volume control. Okay, you press up and you press down. Okay. Not the loudest radio in the world, but then again, look at the size of the speaker. It's tiny. Look. Look at that. It's a tiny, tiny speaker. But then again, this is the good thing. It's a tiny, tiny radio. There is the uh, solar panel on the top. All right. And the little red light there that you can just see if I bring it around like this. There you go. The red light comes on when it thinks it's charging. Okay. So that's nice. Lovely. And then you put it back in the shadows. Red light goes off. Oh no, it's still on there, that bloody old Baldrick. Always going to make me a liar, isn't it? Nice, small radio. Look at this, here's my hand. There we go, look. Nice and small. About the size, when it's all folded up, about the size of two magazines for like an SA-80 or something. Two rifle magazines thick. Alright, so it'll fit in an ammo pouch with remarkable ease. It's got AM and FM on it. Will it focus? Will it? Come on, baby, focus for me. There we go. All right. So you've got uh, AM, FM, and off. A little slidey switch. If you can't work that out, well, what can you do? Okay. Does pick up on AM. I've tried it. Like I said, there are the uh, channel controls there and there. These are the volume controls. There's the titchy tiny speaker. On this end, we have got. Hang on, it's upside down. Bloody old Baldrick. There we go. A DC out of 5 volts and a DC in of 5 volts. It comes with the little lead which goes into... Uh, okay, comes with the lead. So you can charge it from your computer or from a phone charger. Alright, and then when you wind the handle at the bottom, which I'll show you in a second, because this one-handed filming malarkey, what can you do? Alright, tucked neatly away in the bottom here is the handle. Now you pop it out, there she blows. Now, anyone who doesn't know what goes on by now is probably thinking what's going on. Well this is your windy handle, obviously, and when you wind it, the charge light brightly glows, brightly glows, glows brightly, whatever you want to say. One-handed film, and I bloody hate it. Anyway, here we go, look, there's the light. See it? Lovely. It seems to glow in either direction. So I think, whatever you are, left or right-handed, if you wind your wind, you're going to get a charge. Now, that means that this little radio, okay, is a power pack. It's compact. So when you're out in the field, you can have music, okay. You can have uh, a charger for your devices, should you be one of those people that just can't do without something electronic out in the woods, all right. And also, just for the hell of it, you can see where you're going. Because on the end um, is quite a nice, bright, three LED flashlight. All in one package. Now this little beastie, in of course, army green. They do come in other variously vulgar colours, but green is mine. Uh, 12 pounds, 19 pence, good old eBay, like I said, delivered. That's the all-in charge. That's all you'll pay for this little puppy. All right, nice and compact. I've seen some bigger ones out there. I didn't really want to go too big. I just wanted something that was slot in a pocket, slot in an ammo pouch, slot in a side pouch, whatever. And this is the one I chose. The sound quality is not too bad for a little tiny radio, I've got to say. I've been listening to it for a little bit now. Um, comes in white. <laughs> don't lose that in the snow. You know, there's some features in Ying Tong language. I don't understand it at all. USB jack solar panel. Well, that's all I've just what I told you, really. Three ways to charge, solar power, dynamo power, DC in, three LED lights, which is 15,000. Ooh, look at that. Outrageous. Well, there you go. whoop de doo What a little beast. So, there you are. A little tiny radio 
by what's the name of the manufacturer? Ying Tong Ichi Fanny, something like that. I don't know. Look, can you read this? If you can, you're better than me. Rob, help me out. What does that say? And don't tell me it says I'm a camo slut. Yeah. So there you are. Look on eBay. Look for a radio that looks just like that. Pay £12.19 and you will have one to put in your kit. No need to pay millions and millions of pounds for uh, the big expensive ones because A, they're big, and B, they're expensive. They might put out millions of tonnes of charge, but you know what? What do you need really when you're out in the bush? Just something to break up the silence, but to be honest, I like the silence. But this is just to keep yourself abreast of any news, any uh, affairs that are going on. And of course, like I said, it acts as a charger and a flashlight. So, a multi purpose piece of kit. Now going to enter my kit stocks. Okay then guys, thank you very much for watching. Any questions? I don't know, ask the manufacturers. Cheers then, bye.